Konnichiwa. Hope everyone's doing good. Time for an ADC update. So let's get cracking with the knocking. Okay, so I'll start off with the multi-tool. I'm now carrying a knife-based multi-tool, which is the Victorinox. I think it's the uh, handyman. It's got the pliers. Besides that, it's pretty much standard Victorinox, wood saw, file, two blades, excellent pair of scissors, and the chisel. Which I actually use quite a bit, so I'm practicing making traps. Hook also use quite a bit. All that's pretty much the uh, multi tool now. As far as a work knife goes, it's also my EDC knife. But as far as a work knife goes, I'm using this Open L number seven. Excellent knife. Had it for a few years, never really used it. Not really my style of knife, but giving it a go. Very, very easy to sharp, sharpen. It takes a razor sharp edge. Whereas the flashlight goes, still using SR2 baton or S2 R baton. Light. Still. One of my favourites. Still got the Light My Fire ferro rod. And my keys I don't think have changed. Still got the... Uh, if I can get this to focus. I don't even know if it is because I can't see the screen properly. Some lights reflecting off it. Anyway, it's the Phoenix E05. I think you can see that. Uh, Phoenix NW20. Still got the Uncle Bill Slither Grippers. And I put the uh, Leatherman Squirt PS4 back on. And the Boca Plus uh, Pry Tool, which I think is Vox Design. And the little glow in the dark key fob thing, which people keep on saying that's going to give us cancer because it's radioactive. Uh, I doubt it, but we'll see. Uh, Night Eyes Carabiner. It's still got the Boca Plus 50 caliber pen and solid brass. As far as my wallet goes, it's still the Max Edition Urban. Always open this without taking the cards out. Just remember that time just before I opened it. And here, I've actually got money this time. That's uh, Oasis water purification tablets. Enough to purify four litres of water. Survival kit thing I'll go into in a second. The uh, first aid kit I showed in my last video. So I'm going to go over that one again. Still got the uh, BCB survival card. Good tool. As far as what's in here goes, got a seal needle. I think it's number 14, I think, or number 16. P38 can opener. That's a little cover that stops the seal needle from piercing the package. Got some nano paracord. 100 feet of 30 pound spider wire, a signal mirror, a ferrocerium rod, 
little freshwater fishing kit. Got some uh, flies and some hooks and some five pound fluorocarbon and some uh, emergency matches. I'm not going to call them survival matches because I'm sick of everything being branded survival and bushcraft and all of that. So I'll just call them emergency ma uh, matches. And lastly, the 1000 yen coin that my girlfriend gave us before she went back to Japan. I think it's one ounce of fine silver. Got Mount Fuji and a few cherry blossoms on there, I don't know if you'll see it. But uh, that's the wallet. So a watch hasn't changed, it's still the uh, GW100MC G-Shock. Still got the ring. With the bottle opener. And the last thing I carry on my person, a brand new piece of kit. Brand new harmonica. This is Suzuki Promaster. MR350 made in Japan. Wanted something a little bit more fancy than that cheap Chinese one that I've got, so I decided to splash out a bit of money and get a nice fancy one. It's all steel. Well, it's not all steel. I think that's stainless steel. That's aluminium. And it's got some brass in it as well. It's valved, so it's a lot, lot, more, lot more flashy than the other one, which was just cheap, thin aluminium on the top and plastic with a bit of brass on the inside. That's in Hamamatsu, Japan. That's the brand new harmonica. That's the last thing that I carry. Last piece of personal ADC gear, I'll show you what's in the bag. I won't show you everything in the bag because I've already shown that before, but I'll show you one of the one or two new items. So the battery died there. Luckily I've got the uh, battery pack, or the battery bank or whatever you call them. Just managed to charge it up enough to finish the video off, I think. So like I say, that's the uh, Viper tactical bag. Got a Maxpedition Lodge pouch on the front and first aid kit on the side and nothing's changed with this so I'm not going to go fully, in, fully into it. It's all the same. If you want to see what's up there then just look at my last first aid kit video. And in here the only new thing that's really changed is uh, my brother gave us a new camera so I'm going to be playing with this. Just got it yesterday, I haven't had time to play with it, so this is my first time playing with it today. Might use this one for YouTube from now on. So the next video will be uploaded using this camera. It's the Sony Cybershot Exmor. 20.4 megapixel. Really nice camera. Fancy little flash. It's got Wi-Fi, so I can link it to my phone. And send photos and videos to the phone 30 times optical zoom. A few fancy dials for adjusting exposure and whatnot. And settings. Pretty fancy camera. I'll be able to see, I don't think. You can't really see. Too bright. It's also got a hot shoe to add a micro microphone to for better sound quality. So I'll have to look into getting a microphone for it as well. Actually the proper name for it is the uh, DSC HX50. Yeah, it's a brand new camera.
and that's pretty much my ADC update. Everything else in the bag is stuff that I've already shown before. Nothing's changed with that apart from the camera being added. But uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching and goodbye.